Hi there, everybody. A great way to start the new year with you. A happy new year and a successful one to all of you. Martin Tyler and Alan Smith in the commentary box for you today. Our match today, Akisaspor against Antaliaspor. Well, a couple of star names that we're looking at today. What do you think, Alan? I love watching this pair play. They haven't disappointed this season. They've been the most threatening players for me, for both their teams. Well, here is the team sheet for the home side. With the way this manager likes to play, that four is going to sit pretty much in place, and the two in midfield as well. Yeah, that uh, defensive two won't be going too far, they won't be getting ahead of the ball many times, they'll be just trying to feed it into those front four lads This is the lineup for the away side Well, he wanted to play two forwards and the way he can get two forwards in without being too open, I guess is to have the three at the back and the five across midfield Yeah, and he has got uh, a couple of wing backs who have got loads of energy, both good crosses of the ball to try and give good service to those two strikers John McCoo And here comes the counter-attack. Eto, and Eto on target again, and so early in the game. Well, he is a supreme goal scorer, and he wasn't going to miss that one. The goal from Eto. And no thoughts in his mind to blast it. He's just placed it in, side-footed it into the bottom left. And that's a goal well worth analysing again. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Well, they've got to be careful with these early challenges. The referee's penalised that one. We're very early in this game, aren't we? And the yellow card out straight away. Maybe it could be difficult for the player. It is going to be maybe for the ref as well. Oh, well, yeah, I mean, it's a tight work for the player, obviously. But it was an early foul. And I think it's right for the referee to say, yeah, well, that's a free kick. And, you know, you can't do that. Well done, the goalkeeper, and he's hung on to the ball. Decision is a throw, it was a fair tackle. John McCoo. It's a real tussle between the two of them to try and get the ball. typified the competitive nature of this game, that tackle. It's only a throw-in. <laughs> Terrific tackle. be a free kick Sammy Sammy we could be in Rode Jäger very good stop here Kisaspor have a corner now He's fist away by the keeper. He's got support here. Well, he's got his fist to it. Shot on. What a fine save. Well, they're defending the corner now. They're lining up for it. Now he's lost the ball. He's got his 
shot off now. Goes for it with a fist. Able to make a good interception. Another turnover in play here with that interception. Rodri Jäger, a well saved. That will help ease the pressure. Good interception. Well, it'll be interesting to see what the officials make of this snow. I and mean, we don't actually seem to get too many games played in these conditions. When I was a kid, you played on six inches of snow and got on with it. Well, that's right, but with uh, undersoil heating, of course, it tends to melt as soon as it goes onto the grass. But uh, it is unusual, and uh, it might need a bit of concentration for the players. And here's the shot. Comfortable that for the goalkeeper. The ref blows for the free kick. That's going to be a yellow card for this player. We can't have any complaints. So the corner to come. but they are level. It's something of the dying art amongst players these days, the ability to use the neck muscles like that. Great header. So, away we go at one all. We've got four more minutes to play. Added time here. Opportunity now. Easy decision, free kick. It's time now for the start of the second half. Sammy. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Here's the cross. Well blocked. to a throw never quite as simple as you think to throw the ball to one of your teammates and the cross coming in oh it's the post head on and a goal the goal for Neto we just feel sorry for the keeper, really. The way he's hit that to his right, he's got no chance of getting a hand on it. Let's have another peek at that goal. <laughs> Off we go again, 2-1. blows his whistle, the flag was up for offside. That's 
that's an easy interception because the pass wasn't really a very thoughtful one. And that's a foul, and uh, they'll get a free kick for that. Booking from the referee, yellow card. Well, maybe on another day he could have had a little quiet word, but uh, out comes the card. Wonderful save. Had to really reach out for that. I think we'll see with these possession stats, Alan, that yes, the, uh, the game has been even as it seemed without the, the figures to back that up yeah i mean i think we thought coming into this match martin that it would be evenly matched and it's been the case here here's a chance great stop well, that's gone behind it'll be a corner john McCo. well now they've won the ball back in the middle of the park by intercepting that pass. Really strong play in the tackle. What oh, could be dangerous? That's a goal! Actually, Sarsport! And that close in, any kind of a good header is going to beat the keeper. Two teams brilliantly matched in this contest it's level again two players there with a strong tackle between them actually the ball's gone out for a throw neither won it cleanly counting down in the last 10 minutes here nine to go Eto with the attacking run. Very straightforward save for the goalkeeper. Oh, it's great anticipation by the defender, Martin, no doubt. He's a very good individual. chance to whip it in could be a yellow card here for that foul well it was a big opportunity and it's turned out to be a very big miss well he's just swung the boots at it and in the end it's flew by by an absolute mile so really the wrong decision from him we have got four added minutes yeah, and there's a sense of anticipation within this ground. They think they've got a, a decent enough chance now to do the necessary. Sammy. today Alan well he had a good performance and uh, snatched that late goal to grab the win 